Hey guys, so we're moving some stuff around, so there's kind of a mess behind me. There's also a uh, banana <laughs> on, the, on the table. Uh, yeah, so here's a little minion for you. Uh, anyways, I'm, I'm still doing a review for you. So th these are the uh, new Denon Heos One uh, wireless multi-room sound system. So basically what this means, uh, you can get like up to 32 of these. Um, on a single phone, you can connect them to an app and you can just uh, put, just place them around the house and group them in like different rooms. So for instance, you can have like three of them in a, in a living room and then you can put them uh, in a group that's called living room and you can put a few of them in, a, in your bathroom and in your you know kids room and then you can play different music on each and every one of them. That sounds really, really good. Like I'm hyped for this and I can't wait to see how this works. So let's go. So as you can hear, these these speakers are really really loud and they just fill the room and the sound is just shut up. And the sound is just really really good and I have no like no objections to this sound this sound. Uh, I, I I like it's really loud and there's nothing bad to say about it. It's what you'd expect from this you know this speaker that costs this much and. Uh, it's wireless, so that's really good. And if you didn't hear me the first time, it really like filled the the room up, and it's bassy. Nothing shakes. There's no kind of rumbling or treble beneath it. Nothing. It's it's really it's really good speaker. By looking at it, it weighs pretty much. Uh, it's not like like super heavy, but it's definitely like two kilos, maybe even more. Uh, but the plastic is really solid, and everything just really sturdy, like then and always is. Uh, you know, quality. Uh, here is the this uh, kind of stand with a, with a battery. Uh, so this battery lasts really long, and um, there's n not much to say about it. It's it's kind of the same plastic. Every it feels like it's a part of the speaker. Uh, you know, if you just took it like this, you wouldn't even know that it's it's a separate part. Uh, on top, you've got these uh, just three buttons. So it's volume up, volume down, and here is the mute button for whatever reason. And on the back, here is this rubber cover that um, hides the USB dongle for. A Bluetooth connection. So if you want to uh, like have each and every one of your speakers connected to this, you need to get a lot of these dongles. Uh, so that's kind of maybe bad. Now here's the uh, DC input, aux input, and network cable input for whatever reason. Again, I'm not sure. Um, I guess this is maybe for some troubleshooting or if you or if you don't have Wi-Fi in your house. So that's basically it about you know them and how they look and how they feel. It's just really quality, a quality product, nothing else to say about it. Now I had some trouble connecting to this uh, wire Wi-Fi because I don't know how this application is made so poorly, but it just like, I, I would connect to one speaker, but then I couldn't get the other one to work. And then I would connect to the other one, but the first one didn't work. And then uh, at one point I did get them both to work but even though they were in the same group, so they were kind of in the same room, they weren't playing the same music. I was really pissed, so I had to do it all over again. And it had these weird, like, long updates uh, every time I would try to connect uh, connect the speaker. So that was, like, really bad. All right, guys, so this is the application. Now, first of all, this looks like it was made in 2010. Uh, now, I'm not going to judge an application based on its looks, but it just shows me that I have no idea what they're doing. Now, let's say I want to play a song. You go to this phone and you go to search, actually. Uh, and I've got this song from an audio library, St. Gary. All right, so I play it now. It starts playing. It works nicely. Okay. Um, it's added it to a kind of a playlist, I think, but it's not actually a playlist. It's, it's just a queue, so you can't save anything. Uh, volume, you can turn the volume up and down. That works okay. <clears throat> Or not. Look at this, look at this. Uh, this may be due to my connection or my phone, I'm not sure. I'm just gonna mute the speaker right now because I can't get it to stop. Uh, Alright, so let's say I wanna make something like I... Where is that part anyways? Oh, I have to go back. Okay, so here are some some things that you can do. Like you can listen to TuneIn, you can listen to Deezer, SoundCloud, Radio, Radio, uh, this phone, music. So, and now music service. This one is good. 
like really, uh, because you can, basically what this does is lets you connect to your PC or whatever device uh, that has some music on it and you can stream it from there. So you don't necessarily need to play your music for from your phone. This is really, really good. <clears throat> oh, you can make playlists actually. Look here, here are the playlists. Like you have your favorites, history. Let's try it out. What, I, what, I, I don't want an account. Like I don't want to create an account. I just want to play my music. Why do I have to do this? Let's try favorites. Oh, again, account, right. So wherever you go, you need this account. Uh, also, you might notice that there you can't scroll through a song here. If you can, it's something like really, really deep and something really complex. Oh, I just found it. Look. <gasps> Serious. Dude, no. No, you can't. You can. Oh, but there is a shuffle and a repeat. Nice. Alright, so you, you can't scroll through a song, but you can use the shuffle and repeat. So that's something. I was just going to comment how uh, there is no shuffle and there is no repeat button, but I guess they are here, not working um, not working really good. I guess it doesn't let me shuffle maybe because there is only one song in this queue right now. But basically this app doesn't work as it was uh, probably intended to work, and I would really just love if then would let me just connect to uh, the speakers and let me use my own app to play music because this just even if someone someone does like this still it doesn't make like it doesn't mean that everybody likes this app uh, so I don't think it's a really good move and forcing me to just make accounts uh, yeah so there, there you have it those are kind of my first impression slash uh, my review uh, because I really love this idea and I love the sound on these it's just really really good and I would use them even though all the things I've said about the application, I would still use these if I had them. Uh, but I really, really hope that Denon, like, please fix this. Let me use my own application. Don't force me to, you know, just let me to connect to these and then I can play whatever I want from whatever I want. Uh, this is really dumb uh, in my opinion. So yeah. Uh, but if you're thinking about getting these, definitely check them out. Uh, and if you don't have a problem with, you know, setting it up for, for a whole day or something, I, I guess you won't have a problem with these. Uh, but if you're thinking like, oh, I would love, you know, wireless speakers, but these are just a bit too much for me. Maybe uh, this is just, you know, uh, too fancy for you. Check out the Denon's Envia Mini, which is the Bluetooth uh, wireless portable speaker kind of for laptops and phones. It's a bit smaller. I did a review on it a while back. I'll put an annotation somewhere on here. It's a really good speaker and it's really a, like a quality one as well. Uh, so you should definitely check them out if you think that these are kind of a bit too much for you. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, ask away in the comments. If you have these, uh, please tell me. I'm not sure. Maybe this is only happening to me. Maybe everyone else is just having a good time with uh, with this application. Uh, so please tell me. Uh, and you know, thank you for watching. Like this video if I helped you out. Uh, subscribe to this channel and I'll see you soon guys. Bye.